Before the Sixers game tonight, head coach Doc Rivers posed a question about what happened in D.C. today. He told reporters, I'm going to say something that so many are thinking about right now. Could you imagine today if those were all black people uh, storming the Capitol and, and what would have happened? You know, um, so that to me is a picture that's worth a thousand words for all of us. They are the images of shock and awe for everyone watching across the country. Some saw a difference between how police handled the mob of Trump supporters and Black Lives Matter demonstrators this summer. It's caught the attention of Doc Rivers, who's always been outspoken about social issues. You know, when you saw the protests in the summer uh, and you saw the riots uh, or more the, the police and the and the National Guard and the Army, and then you see this and you saw nothing. Um, you know, it basically proves the point about uh, a privileged life. Rioters stormed the Capitol, breaking windows, scaling walls, and taking over offices. It's definitely a double standard. Kasha Stein tells NBC 10 she's been glued to what's going on. She sees a difference between how some demonstrators are treated versus others. If it wasn't uh, the conservative white male population coming in, I think it would have been just like we saw in Philly on the parkway, to be completely honest. I mean, it doesn't have to be all black people. At least one security expert we talked to tonight questioned the police response, believing the National Guard should have been called in overnight and not this afternoon. Rivers noted he saw some rioters escorted peacefully out of the Capitol. You know, if you're a black American, you it definitely touches you uh, in, a, in, a, in a different way. This is not a black thing. This is an American thing again today, and we shouldn't turn it into that. Uh, but it definitely makes you think. A day of history that no one will soon forget. Aaron Baskerville, NBC 10 News.